Would you like to pair a mob down the job with me? What, what's the deal? All you have to do is do your purchase like you normally would. Right. And then just write the amount that you spent right out here on the <laughs> Oh, what's the carrot mob? A carrot mob. It's uh, all you have to do is make your purchase like you normally would, yeah. and they're going to use 75% of the money that you spend towards energy efficient lighting. But what you need to do is write down on this ticket how much money you spent. So go go make your purchase first, and then and write, then down, write down, down how much. Down and give it back to you. No, there's a box at the end of the bar. Just drop it in. It says vote with your money. So it's a box at the end, and so you just drop it in there. Okay, and this goes great. to what? Energy efficient lighting for them. Yes. Fabulous. Yes. Good job. Thanks. As you can see, it's fairly busy in here. Uh, just look behind me, and we've got a pretty good line going. It's um, for an event called a carrot mob, and the best way to describe it is that it's the opposite of a boycott. And what we mean by that is we're bringing in all these supportive consumers through outreach, networking, uh, radio interviews, we're just telling them about it and they come in and they make a purchase and that purchase is going to be used towards energy efficient lighting. So 75% is what Django Java pledged for this event to put towards an energy efficient lighting retrofit. This event in particular was our first carrot mob for Hendersonville, but not just for Hendersonville, but for North Carolina. So it's, it's been a lot of fun to organize. And as you can see, it's a very simple process. Uh, people are catching on to it pretty quickly. There's been a huge positive response to it. I've had people come in that I had no idea were coming. I don't know who they are. They've heard about it through someone else who sent them the email that forwarded it from another email. I mean, the networking was fantastic for this event. Um, it, I don't know, it's, it's been a huge success. I was really worried that we wouldn't reach enough people, but I think at this point we're just over two hours in and I think we've surpassed our minimum. We've already had at least four different businesses approach us to want to do carrot mobs, and I think they realize that they want to make these changes, but they really want that financial incentive, and the positive response from the consumers indicates that Hendersonville can just keep this going. Um, and if the businesses are willing and the consumers are there, we can make changes all over Hendersonville with all our local businesses and see all kinds of positive things come from it. Well, I think it's great. Um, thank you so much for letting us be the first Carrot Mob uh, participants. Um, we like to do things green, as you know. You know, with our compostable cups, we try to do as much as we can for the community. Uh, local as possible. There's just one thing that was missing, and uh, we like to display our art, and we have halogen lights. They suck way too much energy, um, so we've always wanted to get the, uh, the LED lights for that, um, to support the local art and just to brighten up the place with those. So, yeah, we're going to buy those with, with the proceeds for the carrot mob. It's fantastic. It's, Have you been mobbed? Did we get mobbed? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It was great. The support has been phenomenal. Better than I even expected. Better. You see so many, so many faces from the community coming in today, waiting in line, um, and just waiting to support. And it's, it's been wonderful. So yeah. Thank you.